Do you think you've mastered emergency medicine? Let's put your knowledge to the test. Which of the following statements correctly reflects the appropriate initial management of anaphylaxis? As far as your medical management goes, epinephrine is absolutely the correct answer. It is the mainstay of management. And if there's only one drug that you're gonna to give to a patient with anaphylaxis, it should be epi. Epi is given intramuscularly at a one to 1,000 concentration, okay? Again, you don't have to memorize a whole heck of a lot of uh, drug doses cold, but this is one that you really need to know. You don't wanna be fishing around in your phone or looking in a book when a patient is anaphylaxing. You wanna know the correct dose and concentration of epi. So we give it through the intramuscular route at the one to 1,000 concentration, and the adult dose is 0.3 to 0.5 milligrams. The pediatric dose is 0.01 mg per kg, so you can calculate that based on the child's actual or estimated body weight. But for an adult, very straightforward, 0.3 to 0.5. This can be repeated every five to 10 minutes as needed, but if you're having to give multiple repeat doses of epinephrine, you probably wanna think about starting an IV epinephrine infusion um, so that you can uh, more satisfactorily manage your patient over a longer period of time.